Good morning, everybody. This is Donald Blomdahl, Hall of Fame veteran, sports cards, and collectibles. Coming to you live with our Throwback Thursday. Hopefully you all are having a great, great Thursday. For this episode 8, Throwback Thursday, 1990 Upper Deck High Number Series. 7 packs and 1991 upper deck 1991 upper deck 7 packs of each for our throwback Thursday boom 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 we got a whole bunch of people popping in here we go people are getting smart now they're just doing one word per chat I might have to set down some rules on the free giveaway slots for <laughs> boom 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 so we've got a whole slew of people jumping in here as soon as we get the first 1001 in the chat you're alive it's a good day bagwell and sosa rookies ahead there we go socializing with sonia i'm alive i will not complain Okay, let's see who is first at 10.01, and that will be the last entry for the free giveaways. <laughs> for the ent free entries. Free entries. All right. And my computer says 10.01. As soon as I see the 10.01 on the chat there, boom, big raise ball cards and auctions saying, and I am here is the last entry. So let me get, I think we got three people chatting in the free entries, but let's see what we've got here at 10.01. Let me go back up to the top where we started in the live stream. And we start with Big Ray, Bipster, and Sonya. So Big Ray. Big Ray, Bipster, and Sonia. <laughs> so let me count up your entries for the first in the live chat. So Big Ray's got one, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen for Big Ray. <laughs> Let me go through Bipster. How about a roll of... Yeah, I might have to start doing that. A <laughs> rule of five entries. Because, <laughs> you know, when you type in good, and then morning, Donald, and all in the chat. Yeah, you just keep going and going and going and going and going and going and going until... <laughs> uh, 8, 9, 10, 11, 13, 14. About... A roll of yay might have to start doing. <laughs> okay, let me count up Bipster here really quick here. From the one, two, three, four, five. Uh, six. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, thirteen for Bipster. Let me see how many Sonya's got. Uh, bum, bum, bum. Sonya at nine fifty nine has one. One. Oh my word. No, two. Sorry, two. Two for Sonia. Wow. 
That was like a uh, Bipster and Big Ray definitely figured it out. Okay, I think I think the new rule is going to be a max of five. A max of five first in the live chat. How's that sound? Starting tomorrow. I won't change the rule today's. <laughs> that wouldn't be fair. One, oh my word, not too sorry for selling you. Wow, that's like hipster and big. Definitely figured it out. I think the new rule is going to be a max of five. First in the live chat. How's that sound starting tomorrow? <laughs> Are these entries each comment for the first minute? Uh, well, yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, some people are, I, I, I could see when, like, I remember when, uh, some of the, some of the youth in the channel would come in and they would do that, like, uh, oh, I'm trying to remember his name now. He doesn't come in too much right now because he's still in school. And then you have Hunter. Hunter pops in here every once in a blue moon. But we've got five minutes. Let me go ahead and get... Big Ray's 14 entries, and Bipster's 13 entries, and Sonya's 2. Let me get those into the Wheel of Names. So, after today, after today, starting tomorrow and moving forward, we're going to have to just have a 5, a, uh, a 5, 5 chat limit in the first First in the live stream, okay? First in the live stream. I think we're going to do it that way. So let me get uh, Socializing with Sonya's two entries in here first, since that's the easiest one to add. <laughs> oh, my word. Yeah, see? Okay, and then let me see here. Big Rays and Ball Cards has got 14... So let me get your entries in here, Big Ray. There's a five. There's ten. There's fourteen. Then let me get Bibsters 13. <laughs> Bibsters 13. Da -da 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 -da. Let's see. Ah, come on. Hold on. Almost there. Boy, you guys make it difficult when you do, do, do it like that. Okay, let me get Bipster's 13 entries in here. <laughs> yeah, that's going to definitely put a... We'd be screaming up to a 1,000 before you know it when we do this, and then it would be less advantageous. I'm still learning. <laughs> no problem there, socializing. Thought it was just being present. Yeah, I know. That's what I should have done. For every first person in the live chat, in the first, uh, I should do it like a two-minute warning. That way you got two minutes to show up for the program and get into the first in the live chat. Yeah, you know what, Sonia? That actually, that actually does sound better. thought I was just being present. <laughs> okay, there's ten for Bibster. And let me get three more in here. Okay. All right. So now after that onslaught of early bird entries, typing one word at a time and hitting the enter button, <laughs> we have 393 entries into <coughs> the Wheel of Names. So we are doing well here for the start of the stream. We've got about one minute to go. Before we get into our Throwback Thursday 
pack openings for the 1990 Upper Decks and the 1991 Upper Decks. So, Bibster, tell us all the hot cards we can pull out of the 1990 Upper Deck and the 1991 Upper Deck. J Papa 1975. Hey guys, how you doing there, J Papa 1975? Thanks for popping into the stream. Let me get back into my update. We got eight people watching, six thumbs up. Not as quick as yesterday. We were screaming up in numbers yesterday. Let me uh, turn that off. Okay. So other than that, Donald, you can give five of my entries to K. Thompson. K. Thompson. If you'd like to, he almost made it on time. Okay, yeah, if you want to do that, Bipster. Or Big oh Big Ray. Big Ray says give away five of my entries to J. Thompson. Uh, sure, I can do that. I can edit that really quick here. Uh, let me get switch five of big rays. Hold on, let me get ah uh, two, three, four, five. Okay, let me delete that and put uh, J Thompson in here for hold on a second here. Jay. Oh, there he is. There he is. I see him. Let me get Jay Thompson in here really quick and fix that. And then we'll, we're already running late now that somebody wanted to change their their entries. Okay. So let's see. One. Two. Three. Four. J. Thompson. So there's one J. Thompson, two J. Thompsons, uh, three J. Thompsons, four J. Thompsons, five J. Thompsons. Uh, should have typed faster, so would have had more on the last day. <laughs> that wouldn't been no fun if I told you ahead of time. <laughs> All right there, Big Ray. I gave five of your entries to Big Ray. Just call me Spanky. Oh, don't worry, Bipster. I can come up with some other pet names other than just Spanky for the Spankster. <laughs> All right, so let's get back into our content at hand for today. Just got two items on the docket today. Uh, possibly might squeeze in something else. We'll see how the stream goes. I do have a task at hand before the rain show back up. It's supposed to start raining tomorrow in our neck of the woods, and it is cloudy and overcast, but that means it would be a great day since it's not supposed to rain today for me to go out and do my last gardening task. I got to go out and uh, rototill the uh, garden beds so we can prepare them for planting in the not so distant future. I'll probably try and do some videos of my garden bed and get gardening that we do out in the backyard here with our apple trees and blueberry bushes and cherry trees and then our uh, strawberry patch. I'll give you a nice little video capture of our strawberry patch. Yeah, I know. The sec Mariners are in second place now. They lost the other day. But that's okay. T la yesterday they had an off day, so that's why they might have lost some ground too. We were tied for first. But don't worry. They're hanging in there. Kyle Lewis is back. He came back on Tuesday just before they had the day off yesterday. So Kyle Lewis is back in the lineup. So things should start getting better. All right? So we are going to do the Throwback Thursday 1990 Upper Deck High Series number. Looking for the Reggies in these packs for sure. And then in the 1991 Upper Decks, finding the Nolan Ryans. All right? 
and we could find Heroes of Baseball in there and the, the Reggie insert set in here. I will have one more round of these with a few packs I've got left in the upper deck, and then that'll wipe me out of upper decks. All right. Oof, blueberry vines or bushes equals snakes. Uh, we have our we have our blueberry bushes uh, in in pots on our patio. I'll kind of show you in the video if, if and when I do that. Okay. So other than that, I'm going to go ahead and uh, get ready to go into our content at hand right at 10.15 since we're running a little bit behind. Okay, so right at 10.15. And then after we go through these, we will go into the Bipster box. All right, we'll go into the Bipster box. And then as far as tomorrow, we'll probably do our second preview tomorrow for um the people places and the animals or people places and things or what i'm trying to remember the exact title bipster wants me to call that next series after the looney tune tuesdays but we do do have about one two uh three four five six about seven more episodes of of, of looney tune tuesdays okay so for our looney tune tuesday service series we do have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, about seven more episodes. And you'll see how I'm going to progress with that. Oh, by the way, just give you a real quick update. We do have 10, 15, 10, 6, people, places, and things. There we go. <laughs> I knew Bipster would help me out with that one. Um, I, will, I, I put a complete set of Comic Ball 2 cards together, and I was missing one card to have the complete set. So I had to go to Burbank Sports Cards and and down in California, go to their uh, eBay store, and uh, fi found the card that I wanted, but I didn't want to pay four dollars four dollars and fifty cents shipping. So what they do is they have a little deal on eBay. If you buy thirty dollars in products, you'll get free shipping. So I found me some Ken Griffey Jr. cards that I didn't have in my collection, and uh, ended up buying thirty. So I got my card that I'm missing for the the series comic ball series two cards and now I have the complete set all binderized matter of fact I need to move that with my other cards well no not yet I gotta wait until I get that other card and to complete this set so without further ado we are gonna get ready to go in and start with, should I start with the 1990s or the 1991s? Which one should I start with? We got nine people watching. Nine people watching. Nine people watching and only seven thumbs up. Thummies up, thummies up, thummies up for me. But tell me, which one should I start with? The 90s or the 91s? 90s or the 91s? Stretching that collecting dollar father. Yeah, if I can buy cards in place of paying for postage, I'll do it anytime. Uh, let's see. Jay Thompson says 1990. Any other votes in here? Uh, Bipster says 91. I need, you can only vote once. Only vote once whether we go with which one we go first. So Jay Thompson with the 1990s. Bipster with the 1991s. And I need at least at least one more vote. If we get two, we'll have to break the tie. But we do have nine people watching according to my my window here. So we got one vote for 90, one vote for 91. Whichever one breaks the tie, that's what we'll go with. And somebody that did not vote yet. All you got to choose is 1990 or 1991. J Papa, 1975 says 1990, so we'll open the 1990s first. Sorry, Bipster, we'll save the best for last. <laughs> All right, so let's start here. Again, we've got seven packs of 1997 packs of 1991, and we'll see which ones get the better cards. How's that sound? 
scoot those over there so we have space here to put these cards on display. And let's rip open pack number one here and see what we do get. Okay. See if we can get some good Hall of Famers or uh, some of the chase or insert cards that we can try and find in this 1990 set. Pascal Perez for the Montreal Expos. We got uh, Dave Valley for the Seattle Mariners. I'll put the Seattle Mariners up on top so I can separate them out right from the top here. We've got Bobby Thigpen with the Chicago White Sox. We've got Frank White with the Kansas City Royals. We got Jose Gonzalez with the Dodgers. We've got Paul Asenmacher with the Chicago Cubs. We've got uh, Gio Gale oh, Galermo Hernandez with the Detroit Tigers. Bruce Ruffin with the Philadelphia Phillies. And we got us some uh, San Diego Padres. Oh, there you go. You can say, oh, my word, I don't have my hat on. <laughs> we'll put our, our Padres sticker right there. Oh, no, that's not a good angle. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, my word. We got Gerald Perry. Let's see, Gerald Perry. All right. But we got us a Ken Griffey Jr. with the Seattle Mariners. That's a good Hall of Famer there. Ken Griffey Jr. pack fresh card from 1990. That's a second year card. That is Ken Griffey Jr.'s second year card. That's a nice card to add in the collection. Pretty sure I got a bunch of them already. Pascal Perez with the New York Yankees. We've got... Uh, Pete O'Brien with the Seattle Mariners. Then we've got uh, Brian Dubois. Brian Dubois, rookie card with the Detroit Tigers. Then we've got, uh, where did that come from? And then Kevin Mass with the New York Yankees, I believe that is, right? Isn't that the Yankees? Yep. The New York Yankees rookie card and Scott Fletcher with the Chicago White Sox. So only one Hall of Famer in that first pack there. Ken Griffey Jr. Second year card and two rookie cards and a couple Seattle Mariner cards. Boom. That is a nice Ken, look, looking Ken Griffey Jr. the kid back in the day. All right, let's move into pack number two here. Okay. We've got uh, Greg Gagney. Greg Gagney with the Minnesota Twins. And we've got uh, Tom Candiotti with the Cleveland Indians. Then we've got... Uh, Larry Anderson with the Astros. Lloyd Mosby with the Toronto Blue Jays. There you go. J.R. Reynolds with the Pirates. All right. Then we've got uh, Andy Allenson with the Cleveland Indians. Chris James with the Cleveland Indians. Uh, Scott Ruskin. Scott Ruskin, and we've got our hologram card stuck to the back of him. I can feel it on the back there. With the Pittsburgh Pirates, and then we've got the the Minnesota Twins. There you go. I put my baseball cap on, so it's not uh, so scary. The Minnesota Twins hologram card there. Set that in the back behind Ken Griffey Jr. Then we've got... Uh, Damasco Garcia with the Montreal Expos. Drew Hall. He's got braces on. Check that out. First I ever saw that on a ball player. He really jumped out there with the Texas Rangers. And then we've got Louis Meadows 
with the Astros. Then we've got uh, Tony Fernandez with the Toronto Blue Jays. Then we've got uh, Jim Gott with the Pirates, Greg Minton with the Angels, and Darnell Coles with the Seattle Mariners. Bipster says, oh, we, should, we might see a Candyman, too. Oh, that's right. That's right. Candyman went until, what, 1993? So, yeah, we could find a Candyman in here. Add to my Candyman stack up here. My ever-growing Candyman collection here. John Candelaria. Bipster got me hooked on him. He was sending me all these Candelarias. So my can my Candelaria collection is slowly growing there, Bipster. See you later, Jay Thompson. Jay Thompson. Is he taking off? Donnell Hot Coals. Donnell Hot Coals. See you later, Jay. All right, thanks there, guys, for letting me know that Jay was taken off. Hopefully everything's okay. I know sometimes Jay just pops in to, to say a quick hello and stuff. Hopefully everything is good there in your neck of the woods there, Jay. Let's get this out of the way. He must have had some moisture in him or something is my guess. I don't know. Let's see, who do we got here? Oh, we got the Pittsburgh Pirates here. The Pittsburgh Pirates hologram card here. Hol or I'll call it a hologram mini. Felix Jose with the Oakland A's. Then we've got Otis Nixon with the Expos. We've got uh, Bud Black. Bud Black with the Cleveland Indians. Then we got Mariano Duncan. Mariano Duncan with the Cincinnati Reds. We got uh, Greg Cataret with the Yankees. And we've got uh, Bryn Smith with the Expos. Bryn Smith with the Ex Expos. Ron Kittle with the White Sox. Uh, Sean Bosky. Sean Bosky. With the Cubbies. Then we've got uh, Keith Hernandez with the Mets. We've got Ron Jones with the Phillies. We've got Brian Dubois, rookie card. I think that's a duplicate there. Uh, Paul Kilgus with the Cubs. Jeff Montgomery with the Royals, Julio Franco with the Rangers, and Jeff Russell with the Rangers. Okay. So, wow, so far only one Hall of Famer and a small handful of Mariners. Let's move on to pack number four. Pack number four and only one Hall of Famer. Oh, Donald, when do I tune in for the April giveaway? That will be next Friday. Let me double check my calendar to make sure. Next Friday on the 30th of April. So the way my monthly giveaways work there, El Toro 66, is uh, the very last day of the month, unless it falls on a Sunday or a Monday, then I will always do it the Saturday before for the end of the month. Because I don't do live streams on Sunday and Monday. That's my two days off. So I live stream five days a week. Tuesday through Saturday. Okay. Down the road that might change. And I might uh, I'll most likely start taking weekends off when my wife retires. That way uh, I will then stream Monday through Friday. And take the weekends off. All right. And that will probably take place. Yeah, I, I think there must have been a little bit of water damage on these. Because I do see some. And these are, are, they're like foil type. Oh, yeah, this one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this one definitely was affected. Uh, the hologram card is not even hologramish. 
That's how bad it was. Were these stickers? I never did figure this out. Are these stickers? Are these stickers or just hologram cards? I never did bother to peel them off. I'm just trying to, since this one's toast, I want to just test the theory out here. And I think these are, these, oh my word, look at that. I guess these were, these were sticker cards in the, I think they might have been. Because look, I just, I just peeled off the top on this and it is very sticky underneath her. So, hipster, are, the, are these hologram cards, are they stickers? I almost think they're stickers. I'll have to do a little bit more research on there. Just all it says is there's uh all it says is a minimum of one 3D team logo hologram per pack. But this one was toast. That's why I I tested my theory and probably with some of my one some of the ones that aren't good. I'm trying to think what I can't even make out, but I guess because it got water damaged, it did not turn out well, that's for sure. <laughs> uh, don't know. I always just toss them. Yeah, it, I think they might be stickers. But uh, Dennis Powell with the Seattle Mariners. Then we've got here, we've got Vance Law with the Cubs. We've got Keith Moreland with the Orioles. Just holler at me if I'm not centering these cards on the screen. Jody Davis with the Braves. Uh, Mike Witt with the Angels. Um, Bruce Ruffin with the Phillies. I know there was a bunch of Hall of Famers in these packs. Lloyd Mosby with the Tigers. Uh, Craig Graybeck with the White Sox. Um, we've got Trevor Wilson with the Giants. Uh, Kelly Downs with the Giants. Kevin Apier with the Royals. Boom! Another Ken Griffey Jr. sighting. Two Ken Griffey Juniors in these packs so far. Not too bad. Pack number four. Two Griffeys out of four packs. Pretty good for me. Bobby Rose with the Angels. And then this is a checklist card. Uh, George Bell. George Bell with the Toronto Blue Jays checklist card. And Vince Coleman with the St. Louis Cardinals. So two Ken Griffey Jr. sightings so far out of the first four packs. Moving on to pack number five out of seven. Hipster just says, I don't know, I just always tossed them. They were a nuisance. <laughs> oh, there we go. We got one of the insert cards in the back there. And we've got another stuck sticker card. <laughs> yeah, I think these must have had some damage. Oh, yeah, that's another one, see? Oh my word. Good that good thing that Oh my word. Bipster, look what happened. John you you called it. We got a John Candelaria. It's got some slight damage on the back, but we got a candy man. We got a candy man there, Bipster. We got a candy man. Bipster was right. He he sensed a candy man sighting. And we did get a Candyman sighting. It did sustain some damage on the back of the card. It was sticker damage. But other than that, I'm going to keep the card because it's still a Candyman. Still a Candyman. But yes, this, you can see here where part of Candelaria's card got stuck to the sticker. So I guess if these holograms get waterlogged, uh, at least they absorb the moisture for the most part. And let me just see on this one. 
Yep. See, these are very, very sticky. So it, it just must have been the way they made the hologram cards. But we did have a Candyman. Candyman sighting. Candyman sighting. Let me get... Oh, not that one. I don't want... Oh, it's not a rookie card. That is a 15-year 15 15-year 15 card. It has his 15-year totals on the back there. So I will put this in my Candyman collection. John Candelaria. All right. Bipster got it right again. A Candyman sighting. All right. So let's continue on through this pack number five. Mike Gallegro. Okay. Um, who's this? We got Dave Bergman with the Detroit Tigers. Rich Gedman with the Red Sox. Brad Kaminsk with the Indians. Uh, Tim Belcher. Tim Belcher with the Dodgers. I put it down on the table. Uh, okay, there we go. Um, Randy Myers with the Mets. Jeff Hewson with the Rangers. Uh, Bobby Witt with the Rangers. And we've got a checklist. 601. Oh, this is the high number checklist. The high numbers checklist. From 601 to... Uh, I think that's the high numbers, isn't it? Oh, no. 701. 700. So after this checklist is the high number. 701 on up. Rolando Rooms with the Reds. Um, then we've got Gary Sheffield. Gary Sheffield. All right, with the Brewers. We got uh, Bob Ritchie. Rookie card. For the Detroit Tigers. Then we've got a boom. A Jerry Roos with the Milwaukee Brewers. And we got a, wow, our first Reggie Chase card. Reggie Jackson, number 44. A great career ends. Reggie Jackson, Chase card. Card number 8 of 9 in this mini series here. Rolando Hotel Rooms. Your house is smelling like Thanksgiving. You you cooking a turkey there, Bipster? So, boom, we got one of the inserts. Put him right behind Ken Griffey Jr. here, because he is a Hall of Famer, Reggie Jackson. Actually, hold on. Let me just slide him over here for now. For the insert card there, for the Reggie. Moving on to pack number six. One, two, three, four, four rookies. Moving on to pack number six. Uh, Sheffield said he doesn't even recognize the game the way it's played now, days nowadays, and doesn't even watch anymore. Oh my word! Yeah, well. Things evolve with everything, unfortunately. But Jim Gantner, Jim Gantner with the Brewers. Uh, is that Junior Ortiz with the Pirates? All right. Then we've got uh, Joe Bover with the Braves. Don Carmen with the Phillies. Um, Frank Williams with the Tigers. Um, Dion James with the Indians. Randy Myers with the Reds. Storm Davis with the Royals. And we got another sticker action. Oh, there we go. That one's halfway salvageable. No sticker 
damage for the most part on the back, but the Montreal Expos definitely has some water damage the way these cards. And this is one of those sparkly insert uh, Expos, but that one's toast. I don't save the ones that aren't in that great a shape, that's for sure. But then we've got here Juan Nives with the Brewers. Doug Jones with the Indians. Then we've got B.J. Serhoff with the Brewers. Then we've got uh, Don Asse uh, with the Mets. We've got uh, Mike Scott with the Houston Astros checklist card. Mike Scott. And then we've got... Um, John Schmaltzy. There we go. Another Hall of Famer. John Schmaltzy with the Atlanta Braves. Checklist card. John Schmaltz. And we got the same Reggie Jackson insert card. Number 8 of 9. Again, a great career ends in 1987. So a double of Reggie Jackson's card. Insert card set. And Ken Griffey Jr., can we get one more Ken Griffey Jr. out of the seven packs? We shall see in just a moment here. Pack number seven coming up. I see. I see. I see. There we go. That's how we say it. I see. All right. Last pack in the 1990s. See what we got here. Alan Anderson. Helps with the angle I have here. You know what? Let me see. Let me pop it up just a hair. That way I don't have to hold it down so much. There we go. Oh, probably still works better just setting them down like that. Alan Anderson with the Minnesota Twins. Um, Steve Lines with the White Sox. And, we've, and then I'll go through real quick and see if we got any how many high number cards we got here. Felix Furman with the Indians. Tim Launder, La Laudner with the Twins. Miguel Garcia. Miguel Garcia with the Pirates. Then we've got uh, Carmelo Martinez with the Padres. Uh, Sam Horn with the Baltimore Orioles. Uh, Dave Justice. Dave Justice with the Braves. Then we've got Mark Langston with the Expos. Mark Langston with the Expos. Gino Petrelli with the Rangers. Um, Wally Backman. Wally Backman with the Twins. We've got here, we've got uh, Rance Mullenix with the Toronto Blue Jays. And then we've got here, we've got Kevin Tapani with the, that the Brewers? Nope, the Minnesota Twins rookie card. And then we've got Willie Frazier with the California Angels. And Scott Fletcher with the Chicago White Sox. So there we go. Nothing too earth-shattering in those packs. We got, what, one, two, three, four, five rookie cards. These are all low-number rookie cards. Okay, put the rookies over here for now. Uh, we did get the, a couple of halfway decent holograms here. The Padres. The Twins and the Pirates. Most of the holograms were pretty much wasted. Okay. Did get some Seattle Mariners. I'll add to the Seattle Mariners pack in a second here. Uh, let me get these two Ken Griffey Juniors and penny sleeves for now to remind me that they, those go in my Ken Griffey Jr. holdout. For my Ken Griffey Jr. monster sorting process to come up in a stream in the near future. 
We put those Ken Griffey Juniors up there, put my Seattle Mariners over here, uh, and along with the Reggie Jacksons and the John Schmaltzy. Okay. But let's see really quick here how many high number cards we got in the 700 series. Um, here's one high number. Let's see what the high number cards are that we're in. Let me go through these real quick. 798. Ninety seven twenty two seven eighty nine seven twenty one seven eighty eight seven hundred. No, that's right, seven oh one to eight hundred. And let's see the last, nope, 310. Okay, real quick here. 797, 712. Yep, this was an 800 card set for the upper decks this year. 796. Oh, there's another hologram sticker that got stuck there. All right, here we go. Let's set these here. For our base card, for the most part, we've got... Uh... Oh, there we go. That was pretty good. That's the Detroit Tigers. Pretty good little sticker, or hologram card. A little bit of stickiness right there but overall a halfway decent detroit tiger sticker what high numbers did we get out of this set pascal perez scott ruskin ron kittle sean bosky lloyd mosby craig grebeck jeff hewson randy myers storm davis sam horn and dave justice that's a dave a young dave justice there is this justice's rookie I know usually uh, six, six Griffey Jr. is six Griffey Jr. is one, two. Wally back, back, backman. Hey, you guys, it's our time collecting cards. Sloth loves big raised ball cards on, and auctions. <laughs> Bipster. Oh, four Bipster packs today, please. Thanks. Okay, we'll do four there, Bipster. I put three to four more packs just because I thought you might ask for four. All right. So Dave Justice almost looks like a rookie card there, Bipster. It shows 1989 for a high number. Is this a... I'll probably go through and pull out some more of these rookies here. That looks like a very young Dave Justice there. That, I would think, is almost a love watching old wax being ripped. There we go. Thanks, there. So we've got seven people watching, seven thumbs up. Don't forget, thummies up, thummies up, thummies up for me. We put the high numbers on top there really quick. And now we will get ready to rock and roll here. With, um, let me get these off here right now. Put the stack of cards right there for the bases that we pulled out there. High numbers on top. Now we will get into the 1991 Upper Deck. One 3D team logo hologram per pack. 15 cards per pack. Random sequencing temper-proof pack. Featuring limited edition Heroes of Baseball cards. And find the Nolan Ryan card. Okay. So let me get a sip of water real quick here. And then we will get ready to go into the second half of our Throwback Thursday. And after we finish these seven packs here, 
I'll go through and highlight, and then we'll get ready for the Bipster box. Okay, pack number one of seven is up and coming here. All right. So let's see who we get here. In these packs, Brian Harper for our 1991 Upper Deck with the Twins. Then we got Greg Olson with the Orioles. We've got Jose Offerman with the Dodgers. Uh, Cal Daniels with the Dodgers. Carlos Baerga with the Indians. Uh, Chuck Carey with the New York Yankees. Um, here we go with uh, Oscar Azokar with the Yankees. Top prospect card. Top prospect, Dan Peltier. Dan Peltier. Dan Peltier for our top prospect card there. Then we've got Mookie Wilson. Mookie Wilson with the Toronto Blue Jays. Boom. We got a Ken Griffey Sr. here for the Seattle Mariners. Actually, it's a Ken Griffey Jr. card, too, because he's there with his dad right in the picture there. So let's put that up here for my Ken Griffey Jr.'s collection. Then we've got a Pittsburgh Pirates. I like the bigger full-sized uh, hologram cards. Much, much better there. Let's put that there for now. Then we've got Dave Stewart checklist card for the Oakland Athletics. Then we've got a West Chamberlain with the Phillies. Um, then we've got Mike Lacoste. Mike Lacoste for the Giants. And Scott Cooper for our star rookie card. So we've got Dan Peltier for a top prospect. And Scott Cooper for our star rookie card. Moving on to pack number two. I want Dave, that's a Mike Izod Lacoste. <laughs> Everybody has their favorites. The Bashing Years. The Bashing Years. Mark McGuire. There we go. Mark McGuire, star card there. His, a lot of people still like collecting his cards, which is kind of good. All right. Mark McGuire. We put up, put him up here for now. Sean Berry for our star rookie card. Then we've got uh, Dave Stanton, top prospect, 1991 card. Then we've got Greg Hibbard with the White Sox. And then we've got a New York Yankee hologram card. New York Yankee hologram card there. Put the holograms right here together. Put them, put them right behind the, the Mark McGuire there. He might come to an auction in a channel near you. Scott Bankhead with the Seattle Mariners. All right. Next we've got here, we've got Greg Myers with the Toronto Blue Jays. Greg Myers with the Toronto Blue Jays. Then we've got uh, Tim Cruz with the Dodgers. Uh, Scott Bales with the Angels. Um, Tom Branoski with the Red Sox. Um, Mark Davis with the Royals. Tim Nearing with the Red Sox. Norm Charlton. Norm Charlton. Expos. Um, Dave Rigetti with the Yankees and Roy Smith with the Twins. Okay. Okay. 
refresh my chat here. All right, moving on to pack number three. Pack number three. So we've got Dave Rigetti with the Yankees, Roy Smith with the Twins, Dan Plesak with the Brewers. We've got uh, Dion Sanders, Dion Sanders with the Yankees, um, Frank White with the Royals, Mike Scott with the Astros, Kevin McReynolds with the Mets. Uh, Harold Reynolds with the Seattle Mariners. Separate him, him up there with the Mariners. Jose Offerman with the Dodgers. John Shelby with the Tigers. Then we've got next, we've got, oh, got the hologram card there. Do it this way. Brian Holman with the Seattle Mariners. If I would have known, I would have wore the right hat today for this for these 90 and 91 cards. I put on the wrong hat today. I did the Washington State with my throwback train. There we go, National League hologram card. They have they, so they have one for each team in this series, and then they have uh, the National League and the American League emblems. All right, uh, Jeff Montgomery with the Royals. Got our star rookie, Scott Champerino, star rookie. And a Kurt Miller, top prospect for the Pirates in 1991. And Stan Javier with the Dodgers. Okay. Still got five people watching. Eight thumbs up. On to pack number four. Still no Nolan Ryan Chase cards. That's okay. We'll just see what we can find in here. All right, we got Sandy Alomar Jr. With the Cleveland Indians checklist card. We got our Kurt Miller top prospect card. We've got our hologram card for, it looks like, the San Francisco Giants. The San Francisco Giants. Put those in my hologram holdouts there. I got a whole section here on my sort for the upper deck was famous for a lot of the hologram cards. Kevin Elster with the Mets. Uh, checklist card. Um, Gary Gaeta with the Twins. Jose Yaribi with the Giants. Um, Tim Leana with the Reds. Um, Kelly Gruber with the Blue Jays. Joey Cora with the Padres. Bill Long with the Chicago Cubs. Dave Raggetti with the Yankees. Chris Bazio with the Brewers. Alan Anderson with the Twins. Pascal Perez with the Yankees. And boom! Got the Lou Brock stolen base leaders. Lou Brock. That's what Lou Brock and Murray Wills. Oh wait, who, who is that on there? I think this is a this is a double Hall of Famer, right? That's a Lou Brock and Henderson card. Yep, 
yep, yep, yep, yep, yep, yep. So let's see. Uh, we don't have, let's see. Where'd the other Hall of Famers go? I got Griffey there. Oh, the Jackson. I'll put it right here for now. I'll put that Lou Brock and Henderson right there. That's a double Hall of Famer card. That's for sure. Let me uh, penny sleeve that just for a reminder so I don't put it in the wrong sword area. Uh, it has the date on front. Not all have the same date on them. Oh, really? So this is May 1st, 1991, huh? Really? <laughs> Some of them, they don't have... It has the date on front. Not all have the date on them. Oh, okay. Some just has that 939 stolen basis. <laughs> Moving on to pack number five. Okay. Oh, we got a short print. Oh, my word. Stop the show. Stop the show. Did you guys see that? Did you guys see that? Maybe not. <laughs> we'll save it for last. Tom Gordon, D. Gordon's dad. Uh, who do we got here? Bob Kipper. Bob Kipper with the Pirates. Chili Davis with the Angels. Roberto Alomar. There we go. Roberto Alomar. Hall of Famer. Roberto Alomar. Roberto Alomar. Put him right in front there with the other Hall of Famers. Eric Hansen with the Seattle Mariners. Was that the SP3? Which one's the SP3 there, Bipster? You're, you're, you're close. You got the right player, but the wrong SP card. Uh, Randy Milligan with the Orioles. Frank Viola with the Mets. Tony Phillips with the Tigers. Uh... Phil Bradley with the White Sox. Tom Candiotti with the Indians. Uh, Tim Wallach with the Expos. We've got the Minnesota Twins hologram card there. Put that one in the back there. We've got the Ron Robinson with the Brewers. Got the Steve Decker star rookie card. We got the Kyle Abbott. Kyle Abbott. And we've got an SP. An SP card. Nope, not the SP3. Nope. N yes, it is a Jordan. Nope, it's not the SP2. Kyle Abbott prospect card. It's a Michael Jordan. Baseball, Michael Jordan baseball card. I already have a couple of these. But this is the SP1 Michael Jordan. SP1 Michael Jordan. That one gets a penny sleeve for sure. And a top loader. Looks like a nice, pretty SP1 Michael Jordan. Pack fresh. <laughs> Tell you what there, Bibster. Nice hit, well-centered. Yes, it is. We'll see. I'll, I'll talk to you later, okay there, Bibster? I'll talk to you later. I'm pretty sure I've got one or two in my in my PC. So, uh, yeah, we might be able to work a deal on this one. <laughs> Big raise ball cart. Boom, boom, boom. 
We got a bidding war going on here. Got a bidding war. Um, I don't know. We'll set, we'll, we will see, okay? <laughs> nice card nonetheless. The, the Michael George. We still got two more packs to go. We could find another one. We could find another one. Bipster says 11. It's almost like we got an instant auction going on here. An instant auction. That is a cool card. We got to put him in front of Maguire for now. He's going to go right there for now. All right. So we're going to move on to pack number six. Bibby offered $8. Big Ray put $10. Bipster said $11. Big Ray says, just block out those other bids. <laughs> oh, boy. Unfortunately, this isn't my sale, but maybe we'll do an auction next, next Saturday. Remember, my sale's usually the end of the month, but the end of the month ends on a Friday. So on the 1st of May... Is when I'll be having my my next sale. <laughs> Big Ray says, just block out those other bids. <laughs> All right. So the Michael Jordan SP1. Hold on. Let me just check something really quick while we're right here. Okay, so we've got two more packs to go. We could find another one, guys. Could find another one. Why don't we just hold on a second here? <laughs> okay, so let's move on to pack number six here real quick. Let's move on to pack number six in the upper deck. I almost forgot about that one. I almost forgot about the Michael Jordan being in this in that 91 set. Almost forgot about that. Hello. Why is my computer being temperamental on me? There we go. Okay, so we've got Jack Morris, Jack Morris Hall of Famer. Okay, got Jack Morris Hall of Famer there. And we got uh, Dan Peltier, Prospect, 1991. Then we've got the Montreal Expos Hologram Card, Montreal Expos Holiday Card. All right, Tom Brookins with the Cleveland Indians. Then we've got John Cruck with the Phillies. We've got Carlos Quintana with the Red Sox. Uh, Jim DeShales with the Astros. Uh, Mike Felder with the Brewers. Jack Armstrong with the Reds. Baseball Heroes. Baseball Heroes. 1973, a career year for Nolan Ryan. So we got finally got one of the Nolan Ryan inserts. 
1973, card number 11 out of the 18 card set. Okay, then we've got Kevin Remier with the Rangers, Dale Murphy with the Phillies, Kurt Schilling with the Orioles, Bob Boone with the Royals, uh, Jim Jim Acker with the Blue Jays, and Jeff Montgomery with the Royals. One in three boxes had an SP. I've actually pulled a couple. Yeah, so uh, back well back when I started my channel, I did have a lot of upper deck. I did have a lot of upper deck packs. I'm down to my last few. I think I got a few more packs in my box. Or in my pack box. So I will be doing probably one more round of this product. And then I'll be finished with all my upper decks. Okay. Let's go here really quick and see what we got for our last ones here. Ken Hill with the St. Louis Cardinals. We got Scott Cooper. With the star rookie cards. And then we've got a Steve Carsey. Top prospect for 1991. Okay. Then we've got Mike Lacoste. With the Giants. Felt like a thicker card for some reason. And then. Uh, who do we got here? The New York Yankees. Hologram card. New York Yankees hologram. Okay, then we've got uh, Mike Pag Pagliarulo with the Padres. We've got a uh, Kevin Mitchell with the Giants. A checklist card. Tom Brookins with the Indians. Uh, Mike Gallego with the Athletics. Um... Uh, Rich Gedman with the Astros. Kirk McCaskill with the Angels. Um, Chris Hoyles with the Orioles. Bon Hayes with the Phillies. Chuck Finley with the Angels. And Ron Hassey with the Athletics. So there we have it. The rest of that pack. Nice cards to find in here. The the Henderson and Brock card. 939 stolen bases. Alright. A bunch of rookies and prospect cards here. Of course I got to go through the cards and check the other ones out. Let me put that one there for now. Put these guys up here. We did find these hologram cards. The bashing years for Conseco, the Pirates, the Yankees, the Twins, another Yankees, the Expos, National League, and the Giants. The Michael Jordan SP1. The Michael Jordan short print number one. Yeah, I saw it earlier there, Bipster, of all things Wax Pack. We will do four babies. We'll do four babies, and then we'll get ready to end the stream after that. I got some other honeydew list stuff I got to get done today. My wife's been bugging me, so I got to get the rototiller ready and go out and do that. Of course, we got some more holograms here. Let me put these with the other holograms down on the bottom here on that stack. All right, we've got some Seattle Mariners here with a Ken Griffey Jr. These two Ken Griffey Juniors here, along with some more Seattle Mariners on the bottom here. Let me set these off to the side here. I will sort them in their appropriate boxes, along with the the rookies here from these ones. Let me set these off to the side here real quick. 
for our two different stacks of upper deck cards I did here. And we will get ready to get into the Bibster box. Don't worry there, Michael Jordan. We'll come back to you a little bit later. Probably on the 1st of May. Okay. So put those off to the side here. We're going to get ready for the Bipster box. I think I'm going to take the lid off. I think this is how we'll do this for now. No guesses yet. No guesses yet. <laughs> We're going to tip the box over here and slide it back into place so you can see the whole box here. Okay. And then let me... Oh, where'd that... Oh, I'm using the one. I guess I can't use the one I'm going to use the wheel on, right? Kind of did this a little backwards, but that's okay. Okay. Let me get things ready here for my wheel. El Toro. I said to wait, but that's okay. Um, go ahead if you guys want. Choose four different numbers. One through 52. One through 52. Four numbers. One guess per per person. Okay? One guess per person. Go ahead and do that while I get the wheel set up here. Do that while I get the wheel set up. Let's see. I think I can do it like here. Let me get the wheel set up here. Go ahead and put your guesses in. <laughs> Bipster. One, three, four, and two. You're bound and determined to get those one, two, three, or four packs in one of your choices, huh? All right, so anybody else, uh, as soon as I get things set up here, we'll get ready to, to go here. Is it in the way? There we go. Okay. Okay, I think you guys can... You know what, hold on, if I move it a little bit closer. I think you guys can see the wheel there. Oh wait, why was I doing that? I can go back this way. Don't worry, I'll get it adjusted here soon. I forgot I can move this. Okay, there we go. I think I've got it set. So who do we got in here so far? I'm going to give you guys uh, about one more minute when my computer says 1118. We got two people guessing so far. We got seven people watching. Nobody want to get free entries into the monthly giveaway? Anybody want to get in on the monthly giveaway free giveaway? So far, we've got uh, El Toro 66 with four picks. The Bipster of All Things Wax Packed with four picks. Anybody else? Anybody else? If you chime in at the 1118 timestamp, you will be counted. Big Rays is in at 10, 15, 27, and 33. Anybody else at 1118 timestamp? Then I'm going to do a refresh and there will be no more entries. Let me shuffle these up really quick here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Make sure my volume up. No, oh, why did I do that? Alright. 
Okay, I don't want it too loud for you. All right. Uh, what did it? Big Gray, Bipster, and El Toro, you look like you are our three entrants for today for a chance at some free spots in the April giveaway. So let's go ahead and get ready and spin number one. Oh, that's loud. Don't worry, the giveaway wheel is going to be a lot more interesting. Looks like our first pack is 25. Boy, 25 comes up a lot. I don't know why. Okay, close. Spin number two. <laughs> 13 entries was a good day already. Looks like. Hmm, so close there, Bipster. Pack number nine is our second pack. All right, two more packs. Number three, one more pack to go. Pack number forty eight. I don't think anybody chose the packs. Did I miss any? 25. No 25. No 9. Wait, no 9. El Toro got one. El Toro got a 9. El Toro. And then, no 31s. And no 48. So, El Toro, you get a free entry in the monthly giveaway. You get your entry in here really quick. And then we'll move, get ready for uh, the next part of getting another entry. That now gives us 394 entries into the April giveaway. 392 entry, 394 entries in the April giveaway. You guys, you know, you really confuse me when you start putting your entries in before I ask you. <laughs> but that's okay. Go ahead if you guys want to without waiting. Go ahead and choose whether you want the stars or, and I just messed up my little sticker there, huh? Okay, so we are good to go there. Let me close that off, put my phone back on silent. Set that off to the side. Let me switch these. I got to change, I got to re redo my sticker because I wrote on it. I keep forgetting I use this as multiple use. 25, 9, 31, and 48. Okay. So that was the packs we're pulling out. Then we got to do stars. And HOF. All right. Now we get to choose our packs out of the box really quicker. And then we'll get ready to move into phase two of our Bibster box. So we got to pull out pack number 25, which that's 26, 25. Pack number 9, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then pack number 31, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. And the other one, 48, 52, 51, 50, 49, 48. Okay, so we're going to have pack number 25. Yeah, pack number 25, pack number 9, pack number 31, and pack number 48. So you know what time it is before we get ready to get into these now. Let me go into the Bipster Nursery here and pull out the next four packs out of the Bipster box or the Bipster Nursery. This is the Bipster box. The nursery is down here, and I'm going to pull four more Bipster babies out of here. It's being picky to open up here. And one, two, uh, three. Four more Bipster babies. Okay. Okay. You guys go back to sleep now. And we will see you tomorrow for Hall of Fame Friday. We will see you tomorrow for Hall of Fame Friday. Then we'll have another, another episode of Hall of Fame Friday with a walk-off wax. Okay, so we gotta fill in some blank spots here. We got, wait, actually, let's go 20, do the order we pulled them out. There's 25, there's number nine, then number 31, and number 48. Fill in the Bipster babies here. All right. We we'll use this as a backdrop here to display the cards as we pull them out here of the packs. Okay, let me... No spanky cards. I hope not. I hope there's no spanky cards today. Bipster was probably just giving us a sneak peek preview there. <laughs> so let's see. We got El Toro. El Toro stars. El Toro, you can't... Oh, no. Never mind. He just has stars. Bipster has Hall of Famers. Where's, uh, where's Big Ray? Isn't Big Ray here still? Who guessed up above? We have, uh, Bipster, El Toro, and Big Ray. Where's Big Ray? You gonna put your guess in there, Big Ray? For stars, our Hall of Famers? Again, put in whether you want me, what, the order... You think it might take place. So we're going to have 25, 9, 31, and 48 for our packs. Let's see, i got to put these over here. That way you can, you can see them. And then let me lower my box on the table here. There we go. There we go. I think that will work right there. A little bit more space there. And you can see the packs we're going to pull out is... Oh, I can't see it there. 25, 9, 31, and 48. We're going to see how many stars or Hall of Famers we get out of these four packs. Big Ray says stars, okay? We are going to get ready to rock and roll here. If there's anybody else besides Bipster and El Toro 66 and Big Ray's... Make sure you get your choice in real quick. I'm going to get a sip of water real quick. And when my, when the timer on the chat says 11.29, I'm going to refresh the chat. And then there will be no more entries. Then there will be no more entries. Okay, let me get my stream caught up on my computer.
All right. Looking for one last chat in the stream to show 1129. And then I will do a refresh on the chat. So I'll know there are no more entries after my refresh. One more person to chat. It can just be a let's go. <laughs> let's go. Let's get this show on the road. <laughs> One more chat, please. <laughs> it's pretty hard. We're requesting a chat. An 11.29 chat. By the time somebody chats in the chat, <laughs> there we go. Big Ray's Ball Auction says, let's go. All right. I just refreshed the chat. No more entries. So we have El Toro, Bipster, and Big Ray. Let's go. Chat, chat, chat. <laughs> All right. Let's see what we can find here in our first pack here. Oh, I can put you out of the way. We don't need you right. Well, actually, i got to set up my cheat sheet here. Let me set up my cheat sheet, see if I can do it like I did it yesterday, to where it is. There we go. That looks pretty good there. All right. So let's start going through these cards and see if we can get more star players or Hall of Famers. Let the battle begin. Let the battle begin. So we got Clayton Kershaw here with the Dodgers. Uh, that's Todd Helton in it. Todd Helton with the Colorado Rockies. Bob Feller, he's a Hall of Famer. Bob Feller's a Hall of Famer, isn't he? Yep, Bob Feller. Walter Alston. Alston, Hall of Famer. Evan Longoria, that's a nice Evan Longoria card there. Stars and Stripes for sure with the Tampa Bay Rays. Kirby Puckett, Hall of Famer. Manny Ramirez, Ramirez, star player. Jose Canseco, star player. Uh-oh, Jose Canseco, Jose Canseco. Boom, we got one, we're got. we on a Jose Canseco run here now. Gold Cup card, Gold Cup card. Oh, my word, Gold Cup card. Oh, my word, a big run of Jose Canseco. Jim Rice, Jim Rice. Hall of Famer, Jim Rice, Jim Rice, Jim Rice. Paul Goldschmidt with Arizona. Jonas Cespeda with the New York. Cal Ripken Jr. Cal Ripken Jr. Hall of Famer. I'm going to set him up there just so I can keep him separate. John Pesky. John Pesky. Star player. Joe Cronin. Joe Cronin. Hall of Famer, Goose Goslin, Goose Goslin, Hall of Famer, and Jim Bottomley, Jim Bottomley, he's going to be coming up soon, in our biography, Hall of Fame Fridays, Jim Bottomley, okay, so, so far, you can probably, when we do the, the throwback Thursday, you can kind of see the stacks as they're growing here. Right now, I think the stars have the edge. What'd I miss? Let's go, Spanky. <laughs> oh, you are you talking about the, the Jose Consecos? Are they his rookie cards? That's not a rookie card for sure. That's not a rookie. Must include his rookies. Hmm. Oh, the Gold Cup card for sure. Gold Cup card for sure. Interesting. Canseco rookie. Is that what the Gold Cup... Is the Gold Cup card considered one of his rookies? Just kind of curious there. 
Let's go into pack number nine. See who prevails after pack number nine. We've got uh, Euclid, Kevin Euclid, uh, Jose Reyes, is that uh, Erasmus Ramirez, Lajoy, Lajoy, Napoleon Lajoy, Hugh Duffy, Hall of Famer, Kid Gleason, Kid Gleason. Must have been a manager back in the case. He's Stangle. Casey Stangle. Hall of Famer. Juan Marco. 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 Calling all Marcos. Hall of Famer. Tommy John. Star player. Tommy John. Gil Hodges. Gil Hodges. Star player. Francisco Lindor. George Springer. Here we go. Gaylord Perry. Roger Hornsby. Uh, Hal Newhauser. Pie Trainer. Al Oliver. Al Oliver. It's got to be a star player. Yeah, Oliver. He's not the the oh, he's not the Italian O's because in the in the O's you got O'Day, O'Malley, O'Rourke, and the only non-Irish O Hall of Famer is Mel Ott. Uh, Hanley Ramirez, um, Ryan Braun, and Curtis Granderson. All right. As you can see, the stars are taking a commanding lead halfway through. Let's go into pack number three. You would halfway think that Bibster has a fair advantage. But he doesn't. <laughs> oh, there we go. Dennis Eckersley. A fair field Thursday. Dennis Eckersley. My word. He's been playing ball for quite some time there. But Eckersley, Hall of Famer. The Eck. The Eck. All right, next we got a Ted some Ted Williams cards here. Sam McDowell. Sam McDowell. Star player. Uh, Ted Radcliffe. Radcliffe. Star player. And we've got... Uh, Elroy Leon Face. I don't, that's not a name I recognize, that's for sure. Um, uh, mm. uh, Cowan Hyde. Cowan Hyde. Cowan Hyde. Joe Morgan. Joe Morgan. Hall of Famer. Joe Maurer. Joe Maurer. Got some shininess coming up here. Uh, Joe Maurer. Joe Maurer. There we go. We got Frankie Frisch. Hall of Famer. Earl Averill. Hall of Famer. Uh, Sam Crawford, Hall of Famer, Heine Grow, Grow, G R O H, Star Player, Ken Keltner, Keltner, Star Player, Red Show and Dice. Hall of Famer, double, Bobby Dewar, Hall of Famer, Carl Hubble, Hubble, Hall of Famer, Bob Gibson, Hall of Famer, Chuck 
Cartier with the Seattle Mariners. Uh-oh, we got a few Seattle Mariners coming up here. Probably not many Hall of Famers in here. <laughs> Rafael Soriano with the Seattle Mariners. Rafael Soriano with the Seattle Mariners. And Ryan Zimmerman with the Nationals. Okay. Looks like the Hall of Famers rebounded a little bit that round, but we do have our Seattle Mariners up here on top. We've got our Cal Ripken Jr. Okay. We'll just throw Cal Ripken Jr. in a penny sleeve for now to remind me that he goes in my Cal Ripken Jr. collection. Card number 250. Moving on to the final pack, number 48. I am never right. Laugh out loud. I'm sure you're you're just having fun in the chat there, Dipster. But let's see who we got here. Jack Morris. Jack Morris. Hall of Famer. Craig Nettles. Nettles. All right. There we go. Danny Tartable. Gold Cup card. Danny Tartable. Oh, my word. You blew it again. Look, look at all these Danny Tartable Gold Cup cards. Oh, my word, Bipster. I just got my fill of Danny Tartables. Uh, <laughs> then we've got a Raphael Soriano. Earl Averill. That is a thick card. That makes the stack look deceiving when you get those. Earl Averill. Hall of Famer. Corey Seager with the Dodgers. Kiki Collier. Kiki Collier. Hall of Famer. Luke Appling. Hall of Famer. Alex Bregman with Astro. And Tommy Henrik is our last card. Henrik. Star player. All right, let me move this Mariner on top here. All the Mariners. Here, I'll put them upside down so I remember where we where we left off there. No, actually here. I'll put that one on the bottom there. <laughs> they go in the star players. All those Seattle Mariners, they're star players. And I think I think we. Do you really want me to count them? Yeah, let's let's just see what the what the overall total is. We're gonna do Hall of Famers first. We've got uh one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three. So 33 Hall of Famers. On average, with four packs, going to be close to about 80 cards. There's roughly 20 cards per pack. But you'll notice they're slightly off. It's just an average. Just an average. But let's count up the star players. <laughs> Bipster. <laughs> It looks like uh, El Toro. El Toro said stars, and Big Ray said stars, and Bipster's the only one that said Hall of Famers. So I think we know who's going to get their entries. We got what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16 Seattle Mariners. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54. So 54 star cards. 
54 star cards. I don't know. We had 54 stars and 33 Hall of Famers. I think, I think the stars won. <laughs> Pipster. Pretty soon. Look at that. I'm getting close to ending up this sticky pad and got to get another one out. But let me get El Toro and Big Ray two more entries into the Wheel of Names. Let me get Big Ray an entry in here. Oh, hold on. Oh, come on. No. My computer is being picky. Okay, let me get Big Ray. Copy. <laughs> and El Toro 66 gets another entry into the April drawing. And now we have 396, 396 entries into our Wheel of Names. 396 entries into our Wheel of Names. For those that know how this works, every 100 tier we, we break, we add another prize for the giveaway. Lots of tartable, 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 tartable? Oh, Danny Tartables. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you, you, you for some reason sent me a whole lot of Danny Tartables. I did notice there are different colors of wood grain here, though. Must have been the way they printed them up there, Bibster. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. You sent me a dozen. You should have gave me thirteen, a baker's dozen, but you gave me a dozen Danny Tartable gold cup cards. <laughs> Along with one, two, three, four. So you, you sent me 16 Mariners. That kind of stacked the deck for uh Matter of fact, that did really stack the deck. It probably would have made it a lot closer. The Hall of Famers might have won if you didn't stack the deck with Tartables. <laughs> but that's okay there, Bibster. That is okay. All right. So other than that, that was a fun, filled, exciting Bipster box today. <laughs> so we do have 396 entries. We do have everything good to go there. Spamming the packs, Bip. <laughs> Spamming the packs. All right. So let me uh, get ready to reposition my camera here to turn it around onto me. Hey, it's free content, guys. Laugh out loud. <laughs> yes. And I, it is much appreciated there, Bipster. Gives us fun in the channel, that's for sure. Okay, so this has been Donald Blomdahl Hall of Fame Veterans Sports Cards and Collectibles. Having been live to you this for Rollback Thursday, where we did the 1990 Upper Deck High uh, High Number Series and seven packs of 1991 Upper Deck, where we found the Michael Jordan SP1. That was an awesome card to find in those Throwback Thursday packs. All right, and then we did the Bipster Box. Four more packs. That was always fun, and <laughs> Big Ray. Just make it an even 400 entries. That'll get us up to the next tier there, Big Ray. That definitely will get us up to the next tier. 
Let me put four, these four additional entries. Copy. <laughs> Thanks there, Big Ray. You didn't have to do that, but do appreciate it. That's for sure. So let me go ahead and save this. We now have 400 entries. Four, zero, zero. So we now have 400 entries. One, two, three, four. Gets us to 400 entries into the April giveaway. All right. So, so far with, uh, what do we got left? About a week and a day. A week and a day. To see if we can make it up to 500. But we will see. We will see. Okay. Again, don't forget one of the main giveaways on our uh, on our wheel for this month will be a 1988 top set. A 1988 top set will be sent to the first place winner. Okay. So let me go ahead and get back in the stream here really quick. Appreciate that, Big Ray, for that $3.99 Super Chat. Gives you four, entry, four more entries into the monthly giveaway. All right. So other than that, hopefully you enjoyed this, are enjoying this Throwback Thursday. I like the way it displays it on the, on the screen there. You can see it. It kind of does it like a little frame, and it makes it a little, just slightly little around the edges. So that is pretty, pretty cool. It looks cool when, when you watch the replay. You can tell it's like an old TV style. You can see the little, the black spots in the screen. And if, I know, who was that? I think it was uh, Big Ray the other day was saying, how come there's no bubbles? How come there's no bubbles? Well, I can, I can change the filter. We can even go into cartoon mode here. We can even go into cartoon mode. That's for sure. And then, but let me see, uh, where's the bubbles? And I know he, Big Ray likes the bubbles. <laughs> I think he was like, no bubbles? What happened to the bubbles? What happened to the bubbles? We can even do a dance party. Let's go in disco. Oh, I see. It even does like a little special effect when you move. <laughs> Tiny bubbles. Tiny bubbles. Don Ho is Bibby's favorite too. Tiny bubbles. <laughs> we'll just stick with the throwback Thursday luck to finish it. All right. So until... Tomorrow morning for our Hall of Fame Friday. Tomorrow's Hall of Fame Friday will be on uh, Burt Blylevin. We're going to be doing Burt Blylevin's biography tomorrow. That means sometime this evening I got to get Burt Blylevin's cards ready for my my uh, good looksy here. So other than that, I'm going to go ahead and get ready to sign off. You all take care, have a wonderful and blessed day, and we'll see you tomorrow morning. And as Bibby says in all his videos, be blessed. Bye for now. Let me put you back on the, on the break table here as I get ready to sign off. Give me that last shot of the Bipster box. All right, take care, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow morning for our Hall of Fame Friday, along with Walk Off Wax and probably the second half of the people, places, and things. Is it people, places, and things? I don't even remember. Bipster knows. Bye for now. Take care. <laughs>